Rising river and lake levels are causing issues across East Tennessee. We did speak with TVA officials earlier this afternoon. 10 News reporter Emily Crabtree is live for us now at Volunteer Landing. Emily, what did you hear from those officials today? Yeah, Brittany, the TVA says that they've been monitoring the situation with water levels throughout the storm. Now, here on the Tennessee River, water levels are a little higher than usual, but not too high at all. But in other areas across East Tennessee, water levels are rising because of all this rain. During flooding, the TVA holds back water in their tributaries to keep it out of the main river. But they say most of their tributaries are starting to get full, so they've started to let water into that Tennessee River. They're letting the water flow through the fort, throw, flow through into Fort Loudoun, Chickamauga, and other areas. And you might see some slightly higher water levels in Knoxville, but nothing extreme. We've seen increases in lake levels across East Tennessee. All of our tributary, all of our tributaries have been rising. Uh, we have Douglas and Watauga, Cherokee, South Holston, some of those. Those reservoirs are rising above normal summer pools, so those are going to continue to rise throughout the day and into the weekend. They say they're just starting to move all this water that we've gotten throughout the rest of their system. Now, you can monitor wa water levels in lakes and waterways near you on the TVA app. Brittany, back to you. Emily, thanks so much.